So how do you treat an acne prone skin at home? Remember that we are dealing with the fact that we have five times more dead skin cells than an acne skin, that we make a thick sticky oil that lines and goes into the pore, that we have a weak or no hair to take the oil and dead skin cells out on the surface of the skin. So we have a blackhead that's being formed. The key ingredient for me when it comes to that is salicylic acid. Salicylic acid is a beta hydroxy acid. It is drawn to oil. It's like oil is a magnet for it. And it will go into that little pore or that follicle. It will mop up the excess oil in that pore. It will also exfoliate to so remove the dead skin cells, the five times more dead skin cells we have in that pore. And then of course, it will help to get that pore free or open if you'd like. Whereas we're now getting rid of the plug, which was the dead skin cells and the oil. Salicylic acid is also anti-inflammatory. So when you have those sore, pustular pimples, you could even have papules, which is like a blind pimple that sits on the skin. Salicylic acid is phenomenal for that. So I would definitely use a cream that's got salicylic acid in. It could be a spot treatment. It could be a moisturizer. I would use a mask that is a purifying clay mask to absorb excess oil with the clays, but also has salicylic acid in. And I would most definitely invest in an exfoliator product but on an acne skin I prefer to use alpha and beta hydroxy acids I would look for a blend with salicylic acid in lactic acid that will also hydrate glycolic acid that's a small acid that goes very quickly into the skin absolutely phenomenal so those are my three acids that I would really focus on when it comes to treating acne and you can get that across the board at most of the department stores or you can of course speak to your professional that can guide you and help you but for me key with an, with an acne skin is get rid of the excess oil and also make sure that you exfoliate the skin having said that though please make sure that you don't strip and dry and and dehydrate your skin so no harsh detergents no SD alcohols because when you strip and dry the skin your skin is only going to make more oil because it's trying to hydrate and it doesn't know how to make water remember so with an acne skin make sure that you get rid of the excess oil but that you don't dehydrate your skin and I hope that that helps you in treating your skin at home please reach out to me if you need some specific guidance for your skin